It looks like the Mattamy National Cycling Center will no longer be the only building on Pan Am Boulevard as the government of Ontario have finally given the green light for the Milton Education Village. How are you? Good, beautiful day. Let's unveil the great announcement here. After almost 15 years of planning, the Ontario government has finally approved construction of the Milton Education Village. Premier Doug Ford made the announcement outside the Mattamy National Cycling Centre on June 17th. A project that includes new campuses for Conestoga College and Wilfrid Laurier University. Full disclosure, my girls went to both, so I'm, I'm proud that they went there. Great, great schools that will create much needed accommodations for students so they can focus on studying programs in high demand fields such as science, healthcare, engineering, technology and business. All areas align with the hiring needs of this region, which made it vital that we proceed with no delay. Milton MPP Parm Gale expressed his excitement for this project as well. He says it has been quite a journey for his constituents. With a vision, a vision to ensure our young people cannot just live and work in our community, but also have the ability to get post-secondary education and the jobs training right here in our community in Milton. In addition to two post-secondary campuses, a long-term care home will also be built. President of Conestoga College John Tibbetts says they are teaming up with Schlegel Villages to make this happen. We have a partnership with uh, uh, the Schlegels in Guelph. We have a partnership in uh, Waterloo. We're going to have one soon in Kitchener. And we look forward here because in this long-term care facility, what we're going to have is we're going to embed in there training facilities that will train hundreds of uh, PSWs, RPNs, nurses, etc. That's what's uh, really needed. And they're going to be in an environment where there will be no problem finding placements, correct? Because they're going to be right in the homes. The town of Milton is donating 150 acres of this land to Conestoga College and Wilfrid Laurier University. Mayor Gord Krantz says this project is vital to the success of this community. A well-educated community is a very prosperous community. A well-educated province is a very prosperous uh, province. And hence, I didn't need much convincing that that was the way to go. So. I bought into that some 12 or 14 years ago when we started this uh, journey. Now in terms of timelines, the long-term care home is expected to open its doors in late 2023 and the campus a year later. Shovels are expected to hit the ground in the spring. And with this partnership between Conestoga and Wilford Laurier, by the time this is all done, they will be able to accommodate approximately 6,700 students. For Halton News, I'm Melissa Candelaria.